hello everyone welcome to obs tutorials in this video we are going to see that how can we play a video in obs studio that's right in this tutorial we are going to see that uh, suppose you are presenting your screen or you are recording a video and in that particular recording you want to play a video you don't want to record your screen playing that video you want to actually play a video and just show that particular video to your viewers so how are you going to do that so for that luckily we have an option in obs studio that is used to actually play a video source now we have used a similar option in the past where we are using to add images and show the images similarly we can also show the videos the whole length videos on our obs studio screen how are we going to do this let's just see by diving right into the topic so the first step you need to do is go to sources and click on the plus icon now there is an option of media source so just click on that now um, you need to make sure that this option media source visible is checked so that your actual media source is visible on the screen now you can just um, change it suppose i want to name it as vid1 i want to play multiple videos and this is my first video so that's vid1 and click on ok now what you need to do is this is actually a very important step you need to make sure that whichever video you are trying to play it is actually downloaded in your system for a best quality output so once you have downloaded that video or if it is a video that you have actually recorded in the past and you want to just play it it's in your local system that's the best case scenario so click on browse go to the place where you will find the video so i'm just going to open up this video click on ok now there are a bunch of options that are available so the first is a loop so you need to check this option if the video that you have added is a looping video or you want your video to loop suppose it has finished once then you want it to loop and start it from the very beginning so just click on this if you wanted to restart the playback whenever the source becomes active on which the video is there just click on this option if you want to use the hardware decoding whenever it's available use this option if you want to show nothing when the playback ends just click on this option but i don't want that i just want my video to loop so i have checked this loop and the restart playback options and just click on ok now once you do that you will see that this video is actually getting played over here some of the outputs you can see in the audio mixer and here is the timeline that shows me the length of my video is around 4 minutes 11 20 seconds and that is the amount that is, has been played you can just stop it you can uh, get it to the very end or you can just simply keep it playing like this just to see that how is it gonna loop so if i just play it uh, for a few seconds of time it's actually nearing its end and what happens after it uh, ends that's what we're going to see here once it ends it again starts to play back so this is how it is working if you want to change its dimensions you can just change it like this resize it place it over here so what I want is I want to place uh, two video sources over here actually I want to play both of them simultaneously okay so I want to add another video to the same scene so let me just start by clicking on the plus icon go to media source this time it is going to be vid2 click on ok go to browse and let's just select some file this one click on ok i want it to loop i want to restart playback i don't want this option click on ok so second option is this video that is playing let me just readjust it okay so now both of them are readjusted if i just go to any of the sources i would be getting its timeline if i go to any of the sources i would be getting its timeline i can actually just play both of them simultaneously you can see the audio uh, volumes audio mixer volumes and both of them are playing now let us just add another scene and see how the uh, second option that we checked the resume playback is working so i'm just going to add another scene the scene 2 and here i'm just going to add a simple audio input capture device the microphone okay so now i change to my scene if i just go back to my scene then you can see in video 2 the playback has been resumed from 5 seconds now if it goes to 10 seconds i will just switch the scene i have switched the scene to 10 seconds and let us just stay on this scene for a uh, two to three seconds and then go back 
and then again you can see it is restarting the playback it is not resuming the playback it is actually restarting the playback from the very beginning so that's how you can add and work with the different options in obs studio with the video playing with the media source that's it for this video thanks for watching